What's up guys, I'm Cypher and welcome back to yet another video. In this video I'm gonna show you how I made ESP32 cam better. So without further ado, let's get into it. This video is sponsored by PCBWay. More about them later on the video. If you have ever worked with ESP32 cam, you know even for the basic need like uploading the code, there is a lot of wiring. Like every other engineer which facing difficulty, I should solve this problem. Which starts with designing a shield for ESP32 cam. After a few months, I came up with this design, which allow us to uploading codes without pain and unnecessary wiring, charging batteries, easy access to all the GPIO and other features like separated I2Z connection for OLED display and also a no pixel LED. For the USB to TTL circuit, which is able to upload the code directly to the ESP32 chip, I used a CP2102. Also, I could use a CH340 chip, but for this project, I was looking for quality rather than a good price. Part of this project is charging a battery, so for this part, I used TP4056. Usually, you see this chip on the battery charger module. As you know, PCB is the one of the important parts of our project. PCB way help you to get the best PCB quality for your project at a good price. Check out pcbway.com for more information. Also, the link in the description down below. Thanks PCB way for sponsoring this video. So now you know what the deal is. Let's do a quick unboxing and start the soldering. And for now you can enjoy the soldering process. And also don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. It's make me happy. Thank you. As you just saw, the project worked flawlessly. Of course, there are more features to cover, so I decided to use them on the future projects. And that's it for today's tutorial. I see you guys in the next video. Take care.